Welcome back friends. In the last video, we have seen the GNOME desktop of Voyager Live OS. Uh, so XFC desktop was pending because uh, the Voyager ISO contains two desktops. So uh, two sessions are available for the user when he logs in uh, to the Voyager system. So today we will do the detailed review of Voyager 22.04 LTS XFC desktop. So let us start. So we are now logged in into the XFC desktop. So we got a dock at the bottom. There is a panel on the top and uh, foam and file system icons are there on the desktop by default. We have got the Wi-Fi on off toggle here. Below that we have got the touchpad on off. I don't know what is this P3. We will check this out. Let us check it out. What it is. Okay, it is just a toggle to switch this off, the icons off, icon row. Then this is the, what is it, I think, okay. So clicking on this will fix the Firefox set pages. Here you can uh, create a profile for yourself. So it basically is the setting for the Firefox. This is I think screen lock and uh, this is the Wi-Fi network speed. Here this is the weather. Okay. So by default it is showing some place called Maelstroit. So it does not automatically choose and show the current location. What is this? Okay. So here the Voyager theme walls, Voyager wall, night mode, everything is shown. Okay. So you want theme in night mode or a dark mode? Go with the dark mode. Let us go with the dark mode. What happens? We will check. Okay. It shifts into the dark mode. The whole theme is changed. Okay. Now. So choosing the Voyager themes wall, it will show the wallpapers of the Voyager live OS. Let us choose the Voyager wall, what happens? Okay, it opens the Zubuntu wallpapers. So there is a collection of wallpapers here on the left. You can select any one wallpaper from here. These are only abstract wallpapers, I think. No, there are some other uh, outdoor wallpapers also. Let's check out. There is a big collection of wallpapers. You can use any one from them. Okay, let us choose this. Okay, this looks good. So it is little complex. What uh, this Voyager themes? Okay, let us check out what happens. Null theme selected. Let me do it again. Go one to let us select this. There is some issue with the themes also. It is not working. I don't understand, but uh, it is little. Uh, what we can do is. Uh, let us choose this thing. Okay, so now it is working. So some of the themes are not working. For example, Go1 and Go12, it is not working. Voyager 20.04 worked. 
let us check out some more let us check out the voyager celtic look it is also not working yes city man is working this looks good yes city man is okay let us check out the concrete control so this are the conky list conky management to start so we choose the base theme okay time full white so this is the conky here okay let us check out the drive one okay so it opens up the uh, new conky panel here then let us check out what is wine plus gaming okay so this is just a way to install the wine stable from the ubuntu packages so different uh, wine packages are available wine stable wine development wine development from the ubuntu pa packages from the direct from the wine website i think then there is a package uh, there is a option to install the wine config wine install and on installer programs wine file purge wine you can install uh, steam gaming on wine i think or maybe it is just separate uh, for the steam gaming so it will install the steam app then steam uh, full screen and purge steam okay so i will cancel this out what is reparation that we don't know what is reparation i am not able to understand this difficult to understand okay le let us go with the now reparation i could not understand what it is let us go and uh, choose colors icons and panel let us see what is there in store for us no it is also i think not working it is just going back to the voyager themes okay and it is selecting the null theme i don't know what null theme is okay let us go and select the system info so what happens let us see. okay it opens up the terminal and you see the system in info here so voyager 22.04 lts is based on ubuntu 22.04 lts 64 bit uh, kernel is 5.15 generic uh, windows theme is desert teal dark Uh, theme is uh, desert till dark 40 gtk2 and desert till light 40 icons uh, set is gnome gtk23 and terminal is xfc4 terminal terminal font is monospace okay so now i will close this out i will cancel this out let us go and check okay So this is the application menu of XFC desktop. Let us check out what is there in the accessories. So agenda app is there. Agenda app is nothing but your uh, scheduler for uh, your activity. So it will you can schedule the events on daily basis inside the calendar using the agenda. Then there is calculator app. Uh, there is a screenshot uh, taker. The characters app is there maps is there i think this is google maps app then there is uh, usb image writer let us check out the usb image writer okay fail to execute command main stick m iso so there are a lot many issues with this iso it is not properly done or maybe uh, it is not working good in vm but that should not happen because the iso i downloaded and i have checked the iso it is fine only there is no issue like corrupt iso but you see many many things are not working the wallpaper themes are not working many of the wallpaper themes are not working the null wallpaper is getting selected then here the usb writer is not working this is the menu editor the files app is there let us check out the files app it is nemo or what I, 
okay it is the gnome file nautilus is there instead of i think uh, uh, nemo file manager it is nautilus okay let us check out usb disk formatter that is also not working okay we go ahead check some more apps okay so the punar file manager is also there and nautilus file manager is also there let us check out the system monitor xlc system monitor so case up to 17 15% cpu usage is there and memory is around 1.5 gb out of the 3.8 so this is the heaviest uh, xlc desktop i have seen so developers need to work on this to make it light because whenever a uh, user sees uh, as a xfc desktop then he has some uh, conditions in his mind that this will be very frugal desktop it will uh, work on my old laptop it will work uh, on my even new system and lot of memory will be available for other activities people using the virtual manager uh, like wit machine virtual manager gnome boxes normally prefer lighter desktop so more memory is available for the virtual machine so in in those kind of situations users choosing voyager will be disappointed because the system itself is hogging lot of resources now let us go ahead so this is the meteo is the weather app list the application so this shows the list of application the xfc logs is there let us check this out what it is look it is not working many of this application links are not working just not working so this is the notes app there is the font uh, selection and fonts uh, viewer then catfish search file search is there bulk renaming of files is available terminal desktop is there what is synapse let us check out the synapse okay so you can do search within your system using this so you can search all kinds of files using this search Done. Check it out. There is an issue with this. I think it is not working properly. Okay, you can look. I am not able to close this. Definitely, there is problem in this system, or it is not working in virtual machine properly. But that is uh, very uh, less possibility that. Uh, the iso work will work on bare metal and it will not work on vm it can slow down but it should work at least the application should open and close properly it is not uh, even doing that right now okay, let us go ahead look now even the <laughs> menu icon is also application menu icon is also not working so there is a issue with this system i will not recommend it to users at least for now look it, it is just not responding to my mouse clicks nothing is working what we can do is i can delete let us see what happens so look even my action on the power button it is also not working so there is issue with this system so i will not recommend it uh, users to use this gnome desktop was still better but this xfc is not working so users please don't use the gnome desktop please there is a issue with this gnome desktop you can use uh, uh, you can use gnome desktop, uh, desktop but don't use except see desktop definitely there is a problem see the apps are not closing system is freezed look nothing is happening so i close this video here uh, friends in the next video we will uh, do the installation of uh, Arco Linux 
P ISO using the advanced method and then we will try to install one of the desktops and then do a review of the desktop I think in the same video we had a big disappointment with XFC desktop of Voyager 22.04 LTS so we are cutting the review short because uh, whole screen has freezed it has never happened in any of the ISOs uh, of a, any of the different uh, Linux distros that we have tried but it is happening here right here in Voyager 22.04 LTS ISO so I am also disappointed but uh, I had some dreams about this uh, ISO I thought maybe it, it is cool looking and it should work but uh, I am disappointed with the XFC desktop thank you very much do like subscribe and comment on our channel do not forget to press the bell button otherwise you will miss the new videos bye bye